So when are you going to descale the coffee machine? I can't film in the morning videos and not having a coffee machine. I'm sure in the instructions it says anyone is able to descale it, not just Ashley. Hello! Hiya! Hola or oi! Oi! Portugal! <laughs> Greetings. 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 Greetings from United Kingdom. Today we are going to react to Portugal. is not ready for the fact. It's very early on a Sunday morning. I wanted to be in bed. Can we please hear your... Of course, my maybe incorrect facts. So, Portugal has a population of 10.2 million people. Portugal holds the record for the shortest and longest reigning monarchs in the world. So, I hope I pronounced this correctly. Alfonso I Henrique was king for 72 years and 220 days. Okay. 73 years. And Crown Prince Louis Felipe technically was king for 20 minutes after his father was assassinated, but he was then also killed in the same coup. Brilliant. A nearly 74 year king and a 20 minute king. Uh, Portuguese <laughs> is the official language of eight other countries. Lisbon is older than Rome. Yes. And it's stunning. 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 Oh, this one. In 1709, mm -hmm. the earliest hot air balloon took off in Portugal. Fun fact. We love Portugal. We had a fantastic holiday in Portugal. We've been there the first time we've been in this, well, it was my second time in this morning. The first time I was in this morning was a few years back. It was great. Then uh, we went to uh, the, semi uh, the semi-finals last year. Great semi. Great semi, great experience, great everything. And, and we couldn't wait to come back to Lisbon a month after because mm -hmm. that uh, holiday was already booked. And when we came back to Lisbon, we just loved oh. it. Loved it, loved it, loved it. Can't wait. Portuguese people, Bloody lovely. Can't wait yeah. to come back. Mm. If you uh, haven't seen our videos uh, in the oh. holiday for uh, Lisbon and Madeira. We had three days in Lisbon, three days in Madeira. It's oh. Just check us out. Those were my facts. So Portugal is one of the oldest uh, 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 contestants in the, in the competition. They joined in 1964. The best result prior to the winning mm -hmm. two years ago was in 1996 and it uh, they finished sixth place so in terms of positioning in the end table portugal didn't do very well during those years their qualification rate uh is uh three out of eleven Oof. yeah wow it's not really good now the reason why it was only 11 is because they didn't participate in 2013 because of financial mm -hmm. reasons but in 2016 i don't know exactly what happened there but they've decided not to participate because they wanted to uh rethink about the process of selecting songs to eurovision and okay. guess what happened the year after Ooh so they won 2017 with uh, salvatore sobal uh, amar pelas doi that was the song okay well, it did win the majority it was an absolute of smash. the audience and of the, the jury on that night. Personally, I don't think it was the best song of that evening, it of that night. It was not my winner, for sure. And I really disliked the comments he made about some of the other artists. But <laughs> well, no, he'd even mentioned during that year, because that's why Jacques Hudec was so cross. But well done, Portugal, for the well, win. Because well, we well, then had a fantastic holiday there. We, the semi-final again, was brilliant. It's important to say that we enjoyed Portugal. We don't, we don't when we are Just uh, sharing, sharing the feeling about Salvador as a personal. We don't know him. Maybe he's a nice guy. What the media broadcasted to us of no. the things he said made us think I would have Fast advised... food music. I, said. I would have advised to Salvador not to spit to the well you're drinking from. Oh, lovely. Lovely. Right, so, <laughs> Portugal, mm -hmm. this year, the singer name is Conan Osiris. Osiris, Osiris, uh, we don't know. The song name is Telemovel. Tele... Movies? Telemovies? Telemovies. Oh. I don't think it's telemovies. The E and the I are the wrong way around. Mobile phones. Oh. Oh, he thinks he sings about phone. mobile phones. The song is called Mobile Phones. Ooh -hoo. It's important to say, every reaction we are doing here, we are not brutal attack anybody. Although we did kind of attack Salvador just now, but... It was brutal, wasn't it? Yeah. Okay. 
Um, <laughs> so were some of the things he said. <laughs> our comments on this song are just our honest opinion uh, on our first viewing and hearing, and we don't mean to offend, upset, insult, objectify, or make you angry in any way. And if we are doing those, one of those, or more, one of more of those feelings... If, if we hit all five boxes, <laughs> please, <laughs> please let us know, because that would be the full house for us. But we are apologise in advance. So, let's watch, let's listen. Portugal, Let's 2019, enjoy. starting now. Oh. Oh. I... I love it. What is that? Oh, no, whoa, 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 no, 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 what are we watching? Who knows, but I love it a lot. <laughs> it's so weird. It's reminding me, it's making me think like the opening of an Asian horror film. <laughs> the, the instrumentation was a little bit oriental and he looks terrifying. This thing on his hand, the thing on his face, and the music was really oppressive to begin with. Really, it's brilliant. I love the mood of it. It was so weird. It feels like... Kill Bill, Portuguese, ver yeah, Portuguese yeah, yeah. version. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not comfortable. <laughs> I'm really, I'm feeling pain in my chest. <laughs> now, w when we were in Portugal, and we heard what was what was the name the when we had the people singing in the restaurants with us it, was, it began with an F, F, something. Anyway, so I'd assumed Portuguese music had that kind of sound. This is not what I expected a Portuguese song to sound like. Musically is at it, all. Do you think it's Portuguese oriented at all? It doesn't sound like a Portuguese oriented. It sounds like Far East. Oriented. Yeah, exactly. That's my point. It's. I'm not sure where this is coming from. So maybe there is this kind of sound in there in music. What thing. does he have on his hand? I'm not sure. Is he going to kill the other guy? <laughs> Make him stop moving so in so in such a funny way. <laughs> did he fall over? Did he, he fall? He did a jump. He did a jump and fell, or yeah, he landed on the floor. He was meant to. Uh, it was meant to. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. The last scene 
was so powerful mm. when they're, they're kind of dying. I found it too jarring. Like, jarring makes you feel like, oh, It started off and grabbed me, and then I feel like something was off with the production and it lacked enough intensity. So when it, they had the breakdown with just the instrument, there was only one, I could only hear one sound of percussion. It was just a, like a snare. If there was just some more bass and some other layers of music, give it a bit more rhythm, motion, it was... I kind of lost interest by the third time we had that breakdown. I'm still shocked a bit. I didn't find any enjoyment yes, from his voice, not but not in a bad way. Did you feel any emotion? For sure. No, it did make me feel emotion. Uncomfortable emotion. That's well, what yeah, that's what I mean. I it felt was... so uncomfortable because I'm not sure what he's wearing. I don't understand anything they sing, okay? So maybe the, the, the song that has a powerful meaning and apologies in advance if so. But I couldn't understand a word of what, uh, of what the message they're trying to deliver, except that the, the fact that we know the song name is Mobile Phones. Now, I was mainly focused on the dancer. Yeah. Like the dancer stole the, the, the shine from the singer and that I think says a lot about the song. Because if all I care about is the dancer and not the singer, yeah. something is not right, I think. There were times in the verses and the build up to that breakdown where I was thinking, I don't know where we are. And there's, maybe because we can't understand the verse, the singing all sounded the same to me. And I'm really sorry. There wasn't enough motion in the arrangement of that to make me go, oh, we're on a journey. I know where we are in the song. I know what's happening. But in terms of uniqueness yeah. and standing out, this <clears throat> is so unique, so standing out, mm -hmm. and it will do, I think, well, and very, very interesting dancing moves. Mm -hmm. It was it was really kind of... What was it? Can you describe what was that dancing moves? I, it's a lot of at, ballet at some point he yeah. did ballet <laughs> like did that it feels like Eurovision Asia has just started <laughs> but that's our opini opinion what let do you think of it? yeah let us know what you thought about the uh, Portuguese entry in the comment below important question yes we forgot it in the last video yeah so last video Sorry, when Finland. we've seen <laughs> Finland uh, we forgot to ask ourselves who are we taking forward and uh, I'm taking Australia and you take you, you took um, Italy mm -hmm. Yes. Are we changing our mind? No. It interested me, but it didn't make me feel like I ever want to hear it again. I do want to hear it again because I think I had some sort of... Uh, I think I had pain in my chest while I watch, was watching it the first time. I want to be, you know, in a different state watching it again. Let us know in the comments below what you thought about uh, the Portuguese entry. If you like this video, thumbs up. Please consider subscribing to our channel if you haven't done so. Send us a message. Follow, follow us on us Instagram. On, yeah. Facebook as well. And see you very, very soon because there are many, many songs <laughs> to come. Bye! Bye.